So yo guys, what happened today was I got 30 tins of Hidden Fate. I'm giving one case to my boy. I'm gonna put 12 on my website. I'm gonna open 12 on the channel. Open six already, and we've got another six to open. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna do two videos doing Cherizard, Gyarados, and Raichu, the trio, uh, a set of them. So obviously last week we did 30 tin opening. We bought 60, put half on the site. So if you wanna buy Hidden Fates, go on famouscrowd.com. Plenty on there, but yeah, long day today. We opened Champions Path, etc. But this is the 2020 tin. I thought, let me show you the Charizard one, and I'll get the rest of the packs out after. So, boom, Charizard there, and then that's code card for Charizard. So, yeah, you got the cardboard inserts with the cardboard pack holders. So, that's how you can differentiate between the new 2020 reprints and the older ones. Um, but obviously, they reprinted it a couple of times, but this one's an obvious reprint with the new packaging inside. So, let me get open the other packs and we'll get into it. So, boom, guys, we have all three out of there. I put the packs in each pile so we know how many hits we're getting put in and which tin we got them from. Um, here are the code cards for this one's for Raichu and this one's for Gyarados. So, boom. Those are the code cards for the promo. Let's get into it. And then this, I'm going to do it quickly. I'm going to go straight to the rare uh, because we opened so many champions path today. I feel so tired. But then we also uh, did a lot of like, uh, what you call it? We did a lot of uh, 30 tin openings last week. But we got Glaceon. Oh, an evolution. That's what I like to see. Uh, so Glaceon, full art. So yeah, we did uh, 30 packs last week, so we got plenty of videos, so I thought let me throw up some quick ones as well onto the channel, uh, quick opening. So double hit there, Glaceon and the Mewtwo. Did I show you the Mewtwo? I just sleeved up. Mewtwo there and Glaceon. I think this is the cheapest uh, evolution you can get, so that'll be on the eBay as well for you evolution collectors. Um, so let me pile there. So boom, that, we, we st always start with one good hit. So we always start good, so. Um, here look nothing there and then boom like that. Uh, we usually do this sort of opening for uh, straight to the res for like 100 pack, 50 pack, 30 pack openings. Anything like more than 30 packs uh, that isn't a new set I go straight to the rare for. So if you like that make sure to subscribe because we're going to do that a lot now. We only started this last week so some videos may not do that but boom. Uh, just a Charmeleon reverse but then we got the Zapdos holo rare. I'm not complaining that tin was very good with the Glaceon there. The Glaceon probably pays for the tin itself so that tin was basically works out free so let's see if we can do that again with the Gyarados now we've got Zapdos again Color Rare is not worth too much but we're going to sleeve them up put the values there because uh, it still counts as a hit people still buying them etc etc um, but oh so the shinies on the reverse slot and then we have the regular main set in the uh, rare slot, but we had not. Oh, we're gonna have something here. So it looks full arty. Oh, no, it wasn't full arty. Um, there you got a onyx. I saw like texture to it, but I guess it's just the jagged edges, semi jagged, anyways. If it was jagged, it wouldn't be worth PSA. But yeah, last pack of Gyarados. We got a shiny wind pod and nothing behind. So that is the Gyarados tin. And then now we're on the Charizard one. Oh, Charizard, we get Charizard, but look at the misc. Would that get an OC grade? Because I'd probably grade that to get the OC9. I think it is, because look, it touches the line on that side. So, yeah, that's OC worthy, guys. I'm going to try. I'll probably grade it to get OC9. That'll just be fun to get. First OC card in my collection. Uh, I'll probably want put it in. I'll probably put it in a binder and I'll send it like in a year or two. Not fussed with that one. A lot of cards I'm not fussed with. I'll show you some cards I'd be fussed with uh, in a bit. Shall I show you before we open our last one? Yeah, I'll do that. Oh, nothing here. Sorry. Focus with my nose. And nothing in there. I'll show you some cards. So I'll show you some cards we'd be fussed with. This is just some stuff we pulled today. Uh, but here you go. These three Charizards. One of these we pulled in another video. Hold on, the getting confused with the PSA card. So some of these uh, we pulled in another video, but this is the one we pulled from last week. And then we got three of these, which I pulled myself. <laughs> so little teaser onto what we do on this channel. Uh, we literally started this year. So if you like uh, Charizards, you like opening packs, etc., make sure to subscribe here. But we got a Wupa for our very last pack. So not bad. I. Not bad, not bad to be honest, because we do have the Glaceon, which is probably going to pay for most tin and tins. Probably pay for a tin and a half 
And you've got two shinies here. Then GXs we have Charizard, Mewtwo, and Onix. A nice little combo there. And then we have two holo rare Zapdoses. And then we also have the promo cards, which also are worth a little bit of money. So not too bad. I'm really, really happy that we got the Glaceon in this opening. So hopefully we get something cool in the next three. Because that's going to be the last three we're going to open this week uh, for Hidden Fates. But I might open some more. Obviously, I said I got some on the website. So um, if they don't sell quick enough, I might start opening a little bit. A little bit depends how much content we have, how much Champions Path we got to upload. Because we have so many Champions Path to upload. It's crazy, guys. So make sure to like, make sure to subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace.